quick video to show you how to calculate percentage abundance from AR relative atomic mass. So we're just going to use this example. We've got copper, told it's got two isotopes, copper 63 and copper 65. And the relative atomic mass is 63.5. So what we've got to do is calculate the percentage abundances of those two isotopes. So the first thing I'm going to do is set the copper 63 abundance as X. So 63 Cu equals X. Now remember percentages add up to 100. So we've only got two isotopes. So the 65 abundance is going to be 100 minus X. So 65. Cu equals 100 minus X. Okay, so the next thing we do is fit them or put them into the equation, the formula. So the relative atomic mass is 63.5. So that equals the isotopic mass times the abundance. So we've got 63 times X or so 63 X. And then we're going to add that to the next isotope times its abundance. So that's 65 times 100 minus X. And this is all over 100 because we're dealing with percentages. So basically what we need to do now is just solve for that X. So we'll take the 100 over here. So it's going to multiply the 63.5. So that'll become 6350 equals 63 X plus 65 times 100, 6500. And then we've got 65 times minus X. So that's minus 65 X. Remember we're after the X value. So the way I'm gonna do it is I'm gonna take the, six, the minus 65 X over here. It'll become plus 65 X. That'll go over there, it'll become minus 63x. So let's do the full thing, I've got enough room. So it becomes 65x minus 63x equals, so 6500, that's gonna go over there. So it's gonna go minus 6350. That's obviously 2x. And the difference there is 150. So if 2x equals 150, x equals 150 divided by 2, 75. Okay, so 63 is the x, so that's 75%. And 65 is 100 minus x, 100 minus 75. So that is 25 and that is how you do those.